Hello, horsey people. We're back with our Festive Foals Advent Calendar, and this is number four. So I'll leave a link somewhere to the very first one that we had. Now, first thing, we're going to get some money, because we need money. I woke up this morning and my voice is like four octaves lower than normal. Hello, everybody. It's very early in the morning for me. It's like eight o'clock. I know it's not early for a lot of people. But <laughs> oh dear. Guys, we are breeding Comet today. Beautiful stud that we have uh, bred the first time. So the first, uh, I kind of shouldn't give that away really. So the, basically the aim of the advent countdown to Christmas is we are going to be breeding a unique foal that fits in with a Christmas theme. Now you guys have left some amazing names on the YouTube studio here with the comment section. So I'll tell you what, hopefully today one of you guys will be getting a shout out with your if your name is chosen so yeah exciting right so first things first we do actually already have a market mare from the second episode i believe so truth flag here so we're going to breed truth flag with comet and i think we'll probably just leave it at that because we've only bred the one horse so yeah it's just they're really short little sweet videos they're supposed to be little advent countdowns to christmas so yeah, it, it's not going to be like big videos this month, but I think we might have a huge Christmas special. <laughs> That's going to be exciting, right? Oh dear, can't wait. Okay, so let's breed Comet with Truth Flag and see what happens. I actually don't know what's in Truth Flag's lineage at all, so I don't know. I do want to go and race Comet. I, I want to see what he looks like. Uh, he's gonna be really pants, so we go. We'll go to the very first. Bless him. He's not. He's not trained or anything. Uh, so who's looking forward to Christmas or the holidays? You know, uh, I love Christmas, just for the food and for the presents, and obviously the meaning behind Christmas. And uh, I feel sorry for people who who not sorry for people. That's that's probably the wrong wrong thing. But I I just feel a bit like oh, you know, when people don't celebrate stuff. Because even if you don't, you don't have to celebrate Christmas necessarily, but just celebrate anything. I just think you need to put effort into these little things in life. Do you know what I mean? And you get more back. That's what I think. It's very philosophical this morning. Literally, I look crazy, don't I? I'm like, I just woke up. <laughs> I just needed to get this content done. Where are we? Oh, we're right at the back. <laughs> oh, oh, I forgot I was racing. Eat so slow. <laughs> Uh, pigeons! The there the we go. Right the go. Is showing early speed. I always forget there's a helicopter, the like... That's not Chuckle a helicopter, Lady Ranger, that's a plane. So yeah, I've Just bought a whole new system. Actually, I need to check the... Uh, hang on, sorry guys. Yep, that's fine. Okay, back. Where's my mouse gone? It's being stupid. Oh, hang on. Sorry guys. I had to check my mic was on. I panicked. I was panicking. Sorry, there's more pigeons. I bought all my new gear. It's on its way. So I've got like a new gaming PC and everything. So uh, yeah, we're going to be doing the Lady Unleashed gaming. I'm going to change my logo on that uh, that channel though. But any of you guys who want to be YouTubers, um, I'd love to help. I, I'm struggling with time a little bit, but um, just send me an email. But I would say the most important thing is being able to talk to people. As you guys know, I do not struggle. All oh, right, we've got loads of room. I do not struggle with talking and having a like being able to talk to people. It's really important. I don't know why they don't teach us in schools. Ah, look at him. Well done, Cop. He looks kind of happy with himself. My mouse has gone really weird this morning. You know when you're trying to steer your mouse and it goes the other way. <laughs> Go home, mouse. You're drunk. Okay. I like the fact we have loads of money on this <laughs> this game as well because obviously this whole this whole stable block is my original mascot stable block. So I've got uh, Lady Ranger and Gamer, who are all custom creations. I made them myself. I made them myself, and um, yeah, they're really good for topping up your money because they do get you a couple of million each time if they win. Yeah, these three here, and uh, these were just the mascot horses for the channel so i was gonna do basically loads of things with these guys but i just never did i think we just kind of stuck with um ending up having the originals you know like aria and stuff still a lot of money to skip here but if it's rare it's, if it's a rare fault and it fits within a christmas theme then it is gonna stay with us and 
stay tuned and see if your name has been selected for this fourth advent foal. Only if I'm keeping it. Oh, I'm keeping it. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Right, I need to look through all the comments now. Uh, da -da 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 okay. Right, oh my gosh. That's unbelievably beautiful. I kind of, um, I kind of don't want to breed the rare stuff straight away because I'm like, oh, I want the video to be a bit longer for you guys. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, okay, right, so. Great names here. Ooh. Let's care for Fold for a minute so we can go and get some... Tell you what, I'm going to look through some of the names here. <gasps> yes, I know exactly what to call this one. I think. Okay. Who's going to get the shout out then, guys? Let's get a few pictures of the foal and mare. Oh, so happy. It's so pretty. Oh, it's so cute. So who's actually going to follow this whole series? It's going to be a short and sweet series. The videos aren't very long. Oh, that's so cute. Look at it. So it's called Marmalade Motion at the moment. Let's take one with the mum and one with the dad. Uh, get a little shot where the dad's not in the... And we'll put them out in the field. Cool. So exciting. Oh, you guys are amazing. Gosh, the amount of um, names you guys have left here. Good eye from Australia. <laughs> Thanks, Taylor Gaming Edits. Elfie's a great name. Uh, ah, okay, right. Okay, I did see a name that I really liked. I think it's going to be... It's got to be Christmas themed, obviously, like quite generically Christmas. So, uh, let's skip to Mare and name her. I think I've got a name here, guys. Oh, it's so difficult. Um, I just wonder if she's going to go... Paler or not, because I think this will be the decision on her name. So she's quite, like, Palomino-y. <laughs> so, is that a word? No. Zorro and me. You have come up with great names. Loads of you have come up with great names, but I think it's going to be Zorro and me or Olivia Hedborg. You've got some great names as well. But I think... Yeah. This is so cute. I was going to go with Olivia Hedborg's gingerbread house, but I think I need her to be more gingerbread-like. <laughs> more, more orangey. Uh, so I'm gonna go with Zoro and Me's name. I mean this. Oh, cabbie. What oh, fuck? Candy cane. Hey, Zoro and Me candy cane. Well done. That's amazing. Okay, so, uh, <laughs> great. Uh, so yes, right. Put in the comment section below some more names again. Even if you copy and paste from last time, because what we'll do is we'll try and take some of the names from this episode and then we'll name the next advent fall so there we go it's candy cane guys let's take a picture of candy cane it's so pretty ah how fun i love christmas i really do love christmas partly because i don't have to work <laughs> shouldn't say that really hey okay ah oh, so nice that is so beautiful i'm so chuffed i can't believe we've just bred like a super duper rare horse straight away. It does mean we have a mare now. Another mare, which is great. Do we have any other mares? So Rudolph's the stallion. Angel's a mare. Truth Flag is a mare who we're just going to keep on the sidelines there. Comet with you. So Comet did a great job today. Well done, Comet. So we'll have... I might use him in our thumbnail, actually, and say, oh, we bred Comet. Yeah, I'm really, really chuffed with that. Really chuffed with that. So what a great day. Okay. That was good. Right, so that was episode four of breeding for festive foals and an advent calendar of foals. I mean, that's the best advent calendar, right? Yeah. So guys, if you want to see more advent foals, festive foals, then make sure you subscribe, turn on your notification bell. And if you just love horses in general and you've enjoyed the video, then please give it a... I always forget which way the camera is. I'm like, it's over here. Yes, that's a thumbs up, by the way with my little stumpy thumb. Okay, guys, have a wholesome rest of your day. You guys are literally the best people ever. Thanks for creating such a wonderful community. I really, honestly, I'm gonna get emotional. See you later, bye.